times, basketball is like a symphony. It needs to be played by supple and talented hands, and some do it better than others, as is the case with Juan Carlos Navarro, an artist on the court. Bomba because of his rainbow shot. Navarro is now the player with the most appearances ever in the history of the EuroLeague, having reached 253 games and overtaking Teodoros Papalukas. Is a living legend of FC Barcelona. It's Europe's biggest club. Emotionally for me, it's also important because it's the club of my city. I started here at 13 years old, in the first team at 17 years old. I feel fortunate that I have spent my career in the same club. Not many people can say that. It makes me feel proud and I hope it's for many, many more years. The stats not always tell the whole story, but in the case of Navarro, they go a long way to highlighting his greatness. Besides being the player with the most EuroLeague games, in his 13 seasons, he has also become the all-time scoring leader in the competition. Always a sharp shooter, he was especially accurate in 2007, his most prolific season in the competition to date. No one in EuroLeague history has hit the net from the distance as many times as he has. Many of these were scored with that unique style, impossible to imitate. After 20 years with the Blaugrana, there are two nights that he will always remember. I remember the final four in Barcelona a lot. It was not personally my best game, but I remember winning that title because of what it meant to the club and to the city. And also the final in Paris, which we also won. I was an important player there. There have been other games with good occasions in which I remember scoring many points, but those were the most special for me. The final four MVP from 2010 and the MVP for the 2009 season also stand out above all his other personal achievements. A lot of stars have come and gone at Barcelona in the Navarro era, and choosing a starting five, just as a bit of fun, is like dreaming with your eyes open. Radikevic was at point, me at shooting guard. Big men, I think it's clear I have played with the two Gasol brothers. And at three, I'd say Dejan Bodiroga, who marked an important era in the club and helped us win. He is one of the best players ever seen, although physically he doesn't stand out in the crowd. That is why La Bomba is an example for all those who love the game. My game is a little intuitive. I think I probably had a talent because my body is not the most privileged one. That's genetics. I don't have a body with big muscles. But that's why I always work on other things every day, to be able to reach the level. Navarro has constantly improved with age, adding layers to his already immense talent. But he is well aware of where he has progressed the most. I think reading the game, all situations. When I was young, the only thing I thought about was scoring. With time, this has changed. There are some games where you can score a lot, since that is still the most important thing for me. But reading all situations, reading defenses, being more calm to read better and be smarter. 
y estar sobre todo más calmado. When I was a cadet, I think I scored 42 or 44 points in a game at a tournament in the Euroleague. I think it's 35 points or around that. Talent is not something that can be taught. There are times when he has left everyone speechless, like before the game against Partizan Nis Belgrade. He netted 21 consecutive three-pointers. It's more or less normal. I always take the same routine when warming up. Before stretching, I try to have a good shooting streak and sometimes I even score more. But in Belgrade, it was emotional because of the atmosphere and people were following me. It was fun. My record in practice is almost 50 or so. It is an extraordinary career for a normal man that became one of the greatest of all time. I have a family, a wife, two daughters. One is nine years old and the other seven years and a half. And I am happy. When I'm not traveling or in the arena, I try to spend as much time as I can with them. I try to lead a normal life with the friends I had all my life. I try to behave well. I have the respect of all the players and to me that is very important. I am like a player of the streets that was lucky enough to be here and do this for a living.